I think I've found the next South African geniuses and their story is incredible. These two young South African men, both from rural areas, are building fully functioning robots from scratch using scrap and other basic materials. And it is unbelievable how talented these guys are, especially considering they both come from under-resourced backgrounds. One of the gents, Aubrey Shabani from Bushbuck Bridge in Mpumalanga, is literally Tony Stark. He built a whole Iron Man suit all on his own. And it gets even crazier because the other gent, Temba from Bergvo KwaZulu Natal, built a whole homemade car. And he didn't just assemble it or fix up an old car, he built the base from scratch using steel as well as the body using zinc. They both also specialize in building prosthetic prototypes. I mean, just look at this fully functioning prosthetic arm. So their work could actually make a huge contribution to medicine and medical treatment in South Africa one day. And their story gets even more insane considering that they're both self-taught and never received any training. No fancy tools or a workshop, just determination and brilliance. The two gents don't actually know each other, they're just on a very similar mission by chance. They've both posted their work on social media and eventually connected with each other over DM, sharing ideas and assisting each other. But why is nobody in South Africa talking about these guys? Because what they are doing is just incredible. And we need to bring some attention to this story. So I just donated some money to this guy, Mickey J. He's a self-taught engineer from Pumalanga, South Africa. He's basically taking scrap metal and turning it into functional robots with a little bit of AI, some Arduino boards, really, really good talent, impressive young guy. So guys, if you can simply do the smallest thing this week is to help this young man achieve his dreams by donating a little bit, support him. Why it's important is because I know that in the environment where he's at, where he's growing up, I grew up in the same circumstances. So in those kind of environments, people don't care about people like him. If you're not doing music, some form of entertainment, like nobody cares. So guys like this basically just go to trash and nobody notices at all. However, these are the type of people we need the most in society. People that can build things, you know? We cannot survive on just music and vibes anymore. We need people that can build shit for survival. So please take your time, support him. We don't know what the future holds, but um, if you could just keep the beers for this weekend and decide to donate to MJ, that would make me and your ancestors the happiest people on the planet. So do it now. Go to his page on his Instagram, on Facebook. I found him last week and I'm seeing a lot more videos on Instagram of people talking about him. So I'm definitely not the only one who have seen something here. All right. Do that and uh, stay blessed. Wake up. Wake up. You're running late. Wake up. No, no. MJ, I'm too tired. Okay, I understand. You're too tired to wake up. Let me switch you on.